Hi, my dog. Hi. Um, look, um, I've got something here for you. Sure. This is for you. Well, thanks. Yeah, it's, it's nothing. <laughs> oh. It's very special. Thank you. I've been thinking of, think, I've been thinking about you. I can't say it. I really like you. Yeah, I do too. I was wondering if you want to go out on a date. Are we, are we in a relationship or are we just friends? Um, you mean more than friends? You mean? Yes. I, I, uh, <laughs> I never, I never been a date before. It, it's my friend's time. Me too. I, I like talking to you. Yeah, me too. There's really something I want to say to you, but I don't know how to express it. But, I just can't. I I have to tell you something. I'm not sure if you are still in love with Stephen or not. It's complicated. I have no idea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I just to let you know, I'm not with Stephen anymore. Wait, wait, wait. This, this doesn't make sense. Um, <laughs> You're not, you're not with Stephen anymore. No, I'm not. So, you, you do love me? Of course, James. I've always have loved you. So much. Of course, James. Um, listen. I want to tell you something. I've lost Nathan. I mean, yeah, Nathan died. I'm very so sorry. I didn't know that. Sorry. And it's my fault. I don't. I don't No, you don't. You don't. You don't understand. He, he's gone. And he. He's never coming back. You know. He's gone, Madonna. He's gone. I know. I know. I know it's hard. You have no idea. Maybe. You have no idea what I'm going through. Hey, don't say that. What do you want me to say? That I couldn't save him? Hey, James, listen to me. You and Nathan are brothers. We weren't just brothers. Friends? This is what we call it.
you're kill You're clearly not here to help me, are you? Um, hold on, we're talking about. We're talking about Nathan. Nathan was the person who I lost. It doesn't really matter what I think anymore. It doesn't really matter. I'm not doing so well. I'm not in a good place. I've been seeing a therapist and nothing's working. Nothing at all. I'm very sorry. Are you? Yes, of course. Are you really sorry? Because it sounds like you're not. You know what? You don't deserve this. I you saying I'm sorry? I think you should go. Okay. What is it? Nothing. You're, you want me to go or are you trying to push me away? I'm not pushing you away. I just want you, I just want you to understand that there are boundaries. I know about boundaries. Do you? Do you know about boundaries? You understand, okay? It's hard for myself. That is, that's not just that. I've been keeping secrets from you as well. Secrets? What kind of secrets did I think? I haven't been in my right head space. I've been having nightmares. Nightmares? And they just kept getting worse. And I did drugs. I came addicted to them. And that's why I haven't been in a good place ever since Nathan's death. And I don't want to be in the way of that. And I'm sorry that I'm pushing you away. And I know you're trying to help. I get that. I don't think we should be in a relationship. It's okay with me. I'm not doing so good. Aren't you? No. Let's try. 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 let us so, it happened years ago. Mm -hmm. um, I was meant to look after him. Yeah. He was at the. He, um, at a party? No, it was, wasn't at a party. Um, well, that's funny. I saw him at a party. No, you don't understand. It wasn't a party, it was something else. It was at the beach. I mean, not the party, at the beach. And there was, there was something pissy going on. Yeah, about that, but... It was at the beach. Yeah. And... I told Nathan to stay where he is. And he did. Did he go? Yeah. Or was he murdered? He wasn't murdered. 
like I told Nathan, I said to Nathan, Nathan, stay away while I don't go in the water. And you went into the water. But I wasn't there when it happened. Because I had to go somewhere else. I had to race back home to get his medication. But the thing is, I couldn't. You did everything you could. But it was my fault. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. You do not blame yourself. What have you told me about blaming yourself about things? But it was my fault when it happened. Yeah. But, when you look at it, I know, you did everything you could to save him. But a sonic. What does his mum say about it? sonic one coming Who? out. So his mum. Yeah, so at least you're going to see if there's any other well, ones that aren't there. We don't have parents. Our well, parents got divorced. Alright, bye Michelle. Bye. Bye. Oh, yeah, Michelle. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Our our parents got divorced when we were kids. Our like yeah. me and Nathan, like we we had parents but we, we got divorced. I was the only one that had to look after Nathan. Because I already had the funeral. It was years ago. Okay. Like, is it his anniversary of his death? No, it's not. It's just been in my mind. Why did you come to me years ago? This is. It's now been five years. It's five years now. Yeah, it's totally five years. I've told Madonna about it. And I'm going to tell you what she said about it. <laughs> she's concerned. She's just concerned about me. So am I. So am I. And it's not just that. I'll just, I, I am actually going to stay at Madonna's. But I am staying with, with Madonna. Yeah, but I'm not sure about if this is a good idea. Don't you guys hate each other now? She never told you about what happened? What do you mean what happened? Yes, she had sex. We never had sex. You're the father. Yeah, you're the father. I better tell her this. She, she, that's not that's not true. I'm not what do you mean you don't want to do this right now? I told her I don't want to be in a relationship. I have no choice. I mean, I do like her, I really do, but I just don't want to be in a relationship with her. Oh, well, it's a bit late for that. You already got her pregnant. You're going to have to stick around and help her support the baby. Oh, fuck that. You don't have to. I'll, I'll talk to her first. Yeah, and you know what she's going to do, don't you? What? Slap you. She wouldn't do that. Um, she done it to other bloke. Oh, I'll, I'll go and talk to Madonna. I will. I promise. But the thing is, Stephen, I'm not going to be in a relationship with Madonna anymore. Well, what are you going to do about this child? Adopt it, give it to a different family. No, she doesn't want to do that. What do I want to do? My advice? Just get back with her. She loves you. I suppose we are going on a date tonight, so I'll talk to her. You're back together. 
Actually, I've got one question for you. Yeah. What ever happened between you two? Me and Madonna? Yeah. Um, she wasn't wife now. Yeah. Why? Like you, it's okay. How are you? I know it's not any of my business, but yeah. why? Yeah, why would she do that to you? Yeah. Alright, I'll, I'll talk to her. But don't mention the chamber, alright? Fine. Um, yeah. So, and I wasn't in the same she did that. And she wants me to give her another chance. I told her to go because I've got someone else in my life. So, your relationship was toxic? It was toxic, alright. Well, I don't know if anyone. But, weren't you being abusive to her? No, she was too good to me. She won't let me. She won't let me. She won't let me. Right, thank you. So, I've been doing some thinking. Yeah. About our relationship. Of course. And. Yeah. Things between us are. not going to work out. Okay. Steve, you have been telling me what you've been doing to me. Is that true? What? Have you been doing some toxic stuff between you? Uh, it's my toxic. You sure about that? Um, hold on. What are you talking about? Have you been doing some serious, serious bad stuff with him? Uh, not like that. I think I want us to be honest with each other. So you go first. What's your secrets? I have been away a few days ago. Because I'm not, um, there's nothing going on with me and Stephen. 